Hello guys, uh, you are on Bypass Tech RW. Today we are going to look on how we can use different software in making flash disk bootable. It is a very easy things you can do in your life. Like you can use a very simple software that is Lufus. Uh, when we are talking about Lufus, is an open source and a free portable application for a Microsoft Windows that can be used to format <coughs> and create bootable USB flash drive or live USB. You can use command to boot from flash disk and also you can use Lufus and there is different software that can make USB a live USB. Uh, so in history Lufus mean red headed. It is from mayor name from Latin, it's a mere name. Uh, let's see how we can do this. The first things that you need to do is like you search for Lufus software. It is, it is like let's let's check how it looks like the, the details. It is one point one. 1.10 megabyte it means that it's very it is a very small software and also you don't need to install it you just need to to open it uh, so let's open it what you need to do is you need to plug in flash drive that you need to add operating system then you select the disk Now it is opened. The 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 window that I added is Windows 10 Pro. It is ISO image. It's a it's it's it's, it's type is disk image file. It is a an image file. Okay. Uh, therefore, the image option the image option is standard window. It's just we just need to install window. Then you can choose from MBR master boot record or so you can use GPT. Uh, when you are talking about MBR, it is for BIOS, it is rig you, you use rigorous mode. It is often the, the oldest one compared to GPT. So you need to change to check the partition schema of your computer. If it is support only GPT. It means that the target system that we will be installed is UFI. So you need to track the, the type of your computer. So you can also add the volume label. You can you yeah, you just need to you can direct it or do whatever or like you rename it. So I'm not going to remain it to rename it. Uh, another things that you need to do is like you you can use this default one to format the disk therefore you press start after pressing start like how i'm going to do it is start to load to delete the partition then after deleting the partition to start to add the file so format is finished now it is start to adding the window so this software is very quick software to add window. <sighs> the other things that you can do, like you can use command prompt by pressing window plus error, then you will place CMD. So I think we need to stop this copying the ISO image. okay so let's see how we can use cmd command uh the main command that we use is disk part it is disk partition disk part then enter yes so it's a new window come up then we uh, we we can rest we can rest the disk like list disk so we have this disk zero disk zero is our hard drive you don't need to do anything on this drive and also it is a there it is already selected so we need to change the disk to disk one 
sorry we need to select this one now if you see this disk sorry if you if you check this disk now the disk which is selected is this one you can see here okay so we need to what we need to do is to crane the disk okay uh, i don't know what is the error thank you for watching our video and uh, we hope you are enjoying our videos and make sure you subscribe and like and if you are having an issue please let us know how it can help you thank you